Hello friends, welcome back to my channel. Uh, today I have a plan with me for the week of March 30th through April 5th. Uh, and I am recording this on a Saturday, but we currently do not have any internet, so it's probably going to be at least Monday before this goes live. But I wanted to go ahead and get it get, go ahead and get it done so that I could upload it right away when our internet gets fixed. So, this week I decided to use uh, some sample washi that I bought from a gal through Facebook uh, with uh, the Coffee Monsters Co. washi. And so I wanted to do the pink, uh, what are they, little animal onesies. They're super cute. Um, and so then I paired a Simply Gilded washi from, I think it was the Rockstars box, the sub box, uh, just the little pink and blue stars and hearts and stuff like that. So I thought it looked, I thought it went pretty well with the animal onesies washi. So I put that down at the top there under the, uh, at the top, top of the column under the box, the date boxes. I decided to just leave them as is this week and just kind of go minimal up there. And then the other thing I did was grab, well, now I'm going to go ahead and do the the bottom washi here, the uh, Coffee Monsters Co. washi. And I went ahead and put it all the way across the bottom and I decided that I wanted to, <laughs> it was kind of, um, as I was putting the washi down, I wanted the animals to line up. I didn't want any, I didn't want to have to cut the animals in half because <laughs> it just, it just kind of weirded me out a little bit to have like their ha little half bodies sitting there on the bottom of my page. So I cut it after the little pink bunny and then um, just went over to the next page with and cut it after the pink bunny as well so it um, doesn't go to clear to the edge of the page but it was either that or look at their little half bodies and <laughs> I didn't want to do that so I chose to go ahead and do the uh, just cut it after there and have that little space and it doesn't really bother me so all right so now I'm holding down my pages there like I usually need to do to kind of flatten them out a little bit. And uh, we don't have a lot going on this week, as I'm sure most of you, we're all kind of in the same boat. So um, trying to keep our somewhat of a routine and then having um, our school time, which I'm marking here with this pink washi that I got from Michael's. And so we're doing our school time every day and then chores and marking you know, different family activities that we're doing and, and the kids' chores and stuff like that. So uh, I don't know if it necessarily needs to be all decorated like this, but it makes me happy and brings me some joy. So I decided to just go with it like any other week, and it is what it is, right? So um, I went ahead and put that pink washi down there to kind of signify when we will start school, our school time, and then took some more of that Coffee Monsters Co. Washi and just had two little characters up there at the top and cut those to kind of start my sidebar there. And um, I wanted even like I did at the bottom too. It didn't completely fill that space, but it's okay. So then I grabbed my, I went through, I kind of cut that part out, went through my sticker books because it was kind of painstaking to watch me do that. So I cut that part out. Grabbed all my script stickers, icons, and box stickers from Mandy Lynn Plans. And I do have a code to save 10% in her shop, so I will link that below. So I'm kind of flipping through here, trying to figure out which colors I wanted to use for the boxes this week. And I decided that I wanted to do like a color coding for each day. So I decided the first day I was going to pull in that blue kind of color from the top washi. And uh, so I grabbed the boxes from Mandy Lynn Plans and pulled that blue color off of there for the bottom. Um, the Yeah, so I kind of explained this last week too, but we're doing a family time for each day of the week. And so we're playing board games and card games and we played last week, we played a game of horse, a couple of them. So um, I decided to go ahead and mark that in my planner so I can kind of keep track of 
uh, what we do each day. So the that's what I'm marking down here at the bottom with those boxes. So you can kind of see the colors that I chose for each day and I rotated through them. And then I'm going to kind of see how that looks. Kind of something different for me, but usually I don't uh, really, I just do whatever colors, you know, I'll kind of mix and match. But this week I decided to try something new. So I'm going with the color blocking. So we'll see how that goes. All right, so now I am putting down my family time stickers for Mandy Lynn plans on each day of the week there. Kind of sorting through my uh, icons, figuring out what I wanted to use. And the um, this week sticker I chose for our Mandy Lynn plans. And then I decided to kind of make that sidebar, give it a little bit more color. I decided to go ahead and put a little strip of that pink washi down that I used for the school time as well. So I kind of like how that looked. And then I put the this week sticker on top of that. And like I do every week, that'll be my running to-do list, which, yeah, is not full of a lot of stuff right now. But uh, I'm sure that as the week goes on, you know, the kids having more chores to keep them busy. Uh, I'll keep track of that there as well and different chores around the house that I'm going to be doing. Some spring cleaning. I have some closets I'm going to clean out and things like that. So I'll keep track of that on the left-hand side. So now I'm just kind of going through my sticker stack here, kind of figuring out what I wanted to do. Um, I did mark our school time with a little pencil icon, which is super cute, and uh, just kind of that perfect size to mark that. And then I put down a half box there to mark Coffee Monday because Mondays are always, yeah, where I need an extra cup of coffee, maybe two, <laughs> depending on the day. We will see. This no internet thing has it hasn't been as bad as I'm probably more annoyed than my kids are, which is interesting. But, you know, when you get on a schedule of, of doing the videos and it's fun and you look forward to it and then you can't upload it, it's so frustrating. So that's kind of where I'm at now. I'm just annoyed. Uh, so anyway, I'm sure by Monday I will need several cups of coffee to get going. So, and then I have a little coffee sticker from... I'm not sure if her shop is still open. If it is, I'll link it below though, I, like I always do. So uh, then I grabbed a little uh, checklist sticker from, it's a, it's a pencil with a little emoji head sticking out from the side from Coffee Monsters Co. And then I grabbed a uh, cleaning emoji to mark my chores section there that I'll kind of write down the cleaning that I do every week on Thursdays. Uh, I have some little skinny boxes what are they quarter boxes uh, there the pink and the blue one the blue ones to mark a huge load of loads of laundry that I will have to do by Monday because I always take the weekends off and then Monday I'm like oh my goodness it's like a mountain of laundry that I have to do so and then the pink one um, I put down with a little TV icon from Coffee Monsters Co <clears throat> excuse me Coffee Monsters Co to uh, mark down that I want to watch Little Fires Everywhere, which I'm obsessed with, and I really am enjoying that. So I'm looking forward to that. Uh, I have Happy Mail coming on Tuesday, so I grabbed a sticker for that, and it was too wide, so I went ahead and grabbed my slice tool and just kind of cut it down there, and that works. It works really well. Uh, I was going to cut it first before I laid it down, and then I thought, no, I'm just going <laughs> to put the sticker down first and then trim it. To make sure that it was the right size so I went ahead and did that and then I marked that with a little emoji happy mail emoji from coffee monsters co so put that down and yeah it's actually a couple a couple things of happy mail coming Tuesday and actually they may come Monday I don't know I can't check my tracking so it's either Monday or Tuesday <laughs> <laughs> Last time I looked, it was Tuesday, but we'll see. Okay, so now I'm just kind of flipping through the sheets there, deciding what I need to use next. And I got the little Snorlax emoji to mark uh, that I plan on sleeping in on Saturday, which for me usually ends up being like till 8 o'clock. So it works. Uh, it's, yeah, 
<laughs> I usually can't sleep past that unless I stay up late the Friday night. So, uh, yeah. And then I put on a little script sticker from, uh, Planet Fabulously and I will link her below as well. Then I grabbed a little workspace sticker from Coffee Monsters Co. And it's, uh, like a little journaling sticker guy. He's got his little desk with all of his cup of coffee or tea and his books. So I wanted to mark that. Then I'm going to be doing my journaling video and try to get caught up on those with the internet being down as well. So uh, then Friday, I put down a quarter box to mark trash day to remind me to make sure all the trash gets emptied and put out in the dumpster and a little uh, icon from um, a shop, which I need to check on that one too, because I, I'm not sure if the shop is still open. So I will check on that. And if it is, I will link it below. So now I am doing my weekend sticker there from Mandy Lynn Plans. And uh, I love it because it's like the perfect size to fit there. She makes all of her stickers to fit in the Hobonichi planners. So it really works well. So I decided I wanted to put down, just to kind of give it a little bit more color over there, that pink washi again, that little thin strip of washi. And then I put the weekend sticker on top of that to kind of just give it a little more color over there and uh, put that weekend sticker down. And then I'm gonna go in and I decided I wanted to use some, that little sloth um, guy that's on the washi. So I cut him out and then stuck him on the side of the weekend sticker there. So turned out super cute. He's my, currently my favorite little onesie character. He's just adorable. So I wanted to make sure to use him. So. I got him put down and then I'm marking our church service on Sunday will be online. So I wanted to put down a half box with a little heart sticker from Planner-esque to mark that time there. And uh, it's, it'll, well, with our internet being down, we won't be able to watch it till it comes back up actually. So we'll watch it sometime. <laughs> <laughs> Monday, Tuesday, maybe. So anyway, but that kind of marks that side. So, or that event. So then I'm just kind of flipping through, see if there's anything else I need to put down. Uh, and then I remembered that I had a um, appointment for the internet guy to come that I needed to uh, notate so that I don't forget because he'll probably be here first thing Monday morning. So I grabbed a quarter box for Mandy Lynn Plans and put that at the very top on Monday. And then I grabbed a little icon of a computer, a little laptop, and marked the internet guy coming. So hopefully, <laughs> hopefully he's your first thing. Um, but you know, it's one of those things where they tell you, um, they'll be here between 8 a.m. and 4 p.m., which, you know, right now it's not like I'm going anywhere anyway, so it's fine. But <laughs> all right, guys, that's my week. Thanks for joining me. Stay safe.